I'm here at Tesla Burbank picking up my Model 3 Performance Sleeper. We just gotta go inside and finish some paperwork and we can be on our way. Yeah, but what percentage of that is the consumer, you know? That's true. Like what percentage can actually do it on their own? Mm -hmm. And maybe, is that 50%, is that 40%? The funny thing is, this isn't actually easier than doing this as a dealer, but Tesla just makes you do more of the work at home. So can, can consumers actually do that? Who knows? So they say you're supposed to like check all the gaps to make sure there's no nothing wrong. Gotta make sure all the keys work. Look, we already found a paint defect already. You see that? And luckily I read this thing online that says like make sure that you get all your charging cables and it wasn't in there so they're gonna go grab me another one hopefully. Anything that you find on the day of delivery that is an imperfection on the vehicle, we're basically going to fix. Mm -hmm. um, but you do need to create a service appointment within the next 60 days okay. uh, for us to get this fixed. Okay. You. First row! Alright, so we don't actually know how to use this car because we're going to rush out of here and get a delivery. Drive on our way home! Oh. It's really bright outside, I forgot my sunglasses. Where the funny thing is they say that well it's actually our fault but the funny thing they say that Tesla our is fault. yeah the, they say that Tes fault. they say that Tesla <laughs> is more efficient than a dealership but I was trying to get some stuff changed to change our registration address and everything so we actually got there at like 1220 and we just left at 207 without a delivery because we need to get home. We didn't get a delivery or we didn't get an orientation but I think we'll be fine. We'll be able to figure this car out. It's not too complicated. It's got this huge ass screen. Yeah, it's a big ass iPad. Yeah. If you can use an iPad then you can use a Tesla. <laughs> Besides that, the Tesla dealership wasn't as busy so that was pretty nice. It was pretty quiet. They were trying to do like a group orientation which I thought was pretty interesting to have a bunch of people learn about their Tesla at the same time. Uh, but we opted out on that because we're too cool. We're gonna try autonomous driving for the first time. We're heading on the highway right now. Oh wait, and it's rush hour traffic. This is exactly why I wanted this car. No! For rush hour traffic. No! Alright. No, I haven't signaled that I can do it yet. Maybe I have to drive like a certain amount before it signals I can do auto autonomous driving. Okay. Lane. That'd be funny if I just crashed this no, car. No, how why would you say that? Because you always hear about these customers that like buy a brand new car and then like pull right out of the lot and then just crash. Okay. Okay. Please keep your hand on the wheel. It's a uh, 65. It's, it's doing its thing. Oh. Oh, it's breaking. That's cool. Okay. Yeah, it seems we're doing pretty good. Oh, cop just passed us on the left. We're just cruising right now in 28 miles per hour on this California highway. It seems to be doing okay. Ooh, I don't like the car smell. Mm. New car smell? Yeah. Okay, now it's accelerating. Accelerating to 40 miles an hour, keeping its distance. I like the distance it's keeping. I was afraid I might not like how if it wasn't aggressive enough. So this is actually pretty good. Apply slight force to steering wheel. Uh, it thinks I'm not holding the wheel. We're accelerating to 55. Okay, the truck is getting out of our lane. It's actually kind of scary. I gotta trust, trust in the Tesla. Okay, it's breaking out. Damn, that brake's pretty tough. <laughs> Should I name the car Red Rocket? <laughs> Steve's Red Rocket. <laughs> so thanks for watching. I bought this Model 3 as a commuter. I wanted to make videos about it, I wanted to turbo it, and I wanted to really test the full self-driving capabilities in Los Angeles. So if you're interested in any of that, hit that like and hit that subscribe. See ya!